Welcome back to my channel guys, it's your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle and styling guys. So today I wasn't going to do a video about my spark aligners but guys, alright so I know I this is week 6 and I'm not going to do one every week because I do change them once a week and it just seems a bit frequent for you guys. So. I'm just gonna chat with you guys about what I'm feeling <laughs> today. So I change my aligners every Monday night. Um, that way when I do go to sleep, whatever pain that I may be feeling, I won't feel it until, well I won't feel it at all. And possibly may feel it in the morning. So, I woke up this morning and they don't hurt like bad but I definitely know that there is some shifting going on. <laughs> um, I did see a video recently where a young lady kept saying she was in so much pain, she had to take pills and stuff. I have not gotten to that point yet, guys. Um, someone told me because I don't have a lot of shifting to do, uh, and that could possibly be it, or it could be that I'm changing them weekly, I don't know. But I know today I felt a little bit of pain. Now, what I did do today differently at work was talk a lot more. So, I wonder if that could have been it, that I was moving my mouth a little bit more, because typically I'm home, I'm listening to music while I'm working. Um, if I am on the phone, it's not really long, but I am finding that I'm talking a little different. Uh, this tray doesn't feel as big as the other ones, but I'm definitely feeling some discomfort Today. And again, this is tray six, so, is this tray six? Yes, yeah, so this is week six, so it's a month and a week, right? I do go back in once I hit tray 10, so they can shave down the center because of that whole triangle thing, that black triangle, which is technically like a little space, so they can fill that back up. I'm also noticing that I'm talking like a little tight mouth. I don't know, like, I don't know, it's very weird, I can't explain it, but I'm gonna show you guys how everything is going, I'm closer. I'm a little greasy today, guys, because I put on Vaseline. But here they are. I'm still waiting for this one to close in a little bit. Um, and it probably has something to do with this bottom tooth. Um, and my, my buttons have stayed on. The top is good, too. The top is good. I, I'm definitely paying attention to certain things, but uh, my buttons are still on. I haven't had any issues with those falling off. Um, eating has been fine. Um, I, okay, I'm not gonna lie guys. When I go out, I hate to use the bathroom with my toothbrush. I think it's gross as heck. So, <laughs> I rinse really, really well guys. And this is honest, this is the truth. And I just put them in because I know I'm on my way home and then I just floss, well I'll floss at the at the restaurant, but I won't brush there, and I'll just rinse really well, get any food out with just like plain water, um, and just get it out. But to actually sit there and brush, I can't do it in the restaurant. So that's what I've been doing, um, and I haven't had any discomfort putting it back in. So I typically am like 40 minutes away from my home if I go out, so, but at least that they're in. But when I get home, I do do a thorough cleaning, and I brush them and stuff like that. So as far as like the color, I haven't had any issues where they're turning color on me. So I did hear someone say that theirs was turning. I like curry, I don't eat it. Since you guys know I'm an alkaline vegan, we're not supposed to have it. But occasionally I will eat it, but I haven't eaten any since I got on the Spark Aligners. And I probably won't if I did it would probably be the day that I am changing them out. Um, but I haven't went there yet. Also, let's see what else. That's it, that's it for the aligners. I think that was a pretty good, just like, little update. Um, and let's see what else. Discomfort, there's no color changing. Uh, these trays feel a little bit better as far as the fit than the last couple of weeks. Um, Cause I think I told you guys I felt like it wasn't moving but definitely last night is doing something and um 
and that's it and just going out to eat guys listen if you are if you do have any spark aligners or invisalign i know it's difficult when you go out to eat but just if you don't want to brush out make sure you are getting any excess food out of your mouth and out of your teeth because they are shifting you may have food stuck in places that never used to get stuck before um so keep an eye out on that and keep an eye out on any attachments that they have on your teeth make sure that whenever you are changing your trays that you have the same amount of attachments that they put when you first got your aligners done <laughs> that way you don't have to go back in and have them put them on but i know for a fact that i am going to ask for extra trays after my six months because i did take a look at the last tray and they're straight but i still see a little bit of crookedness in my opinion um so i'll probably go until december since I already started um, eating, guys, I'm already slim, so I still eat. I don't care. Like I take them out. I'll eat my snacks. Um, sometimes what I was do what I was doing at first was eating my dinner, eating my snack right after. So I stopped that. I'll eat, give it a break, brush my teeth, put them back in, do some work, end up doing my um, eating a, eating a snack right before bed, and then brushing again so it doesn't really bother me blushing, bl brushing and flossing again so it doesn't bother me um so I know people saying that they're losing weight on it because they're not snacking I'm snacking guys and what else I think that's pretty much it as far as whitening my teeth after I would like to do it um I seen this young lady get her teeth whitened I'm not sure what they use but her teeth were looking amazing guys um I don't want them white like veneers i want them to be natural and i just want them to be straight like they used to i am getting older so they are shifting so guys that is a quick little update of my spark aligners week six in the pain that i'm feeling right now and um me going out with my spark aligners guys so that is it um what else can i talk to you guys about that's it that's it the only thing i did over the weekend was like um i went to this vegan spot I should have done a separate video in Georgia called Bad Gal Vegan. Um, I'm probably gonna put that in the description, guys, because I think people may wanna know about it. Um, it's a Jamaican spot. It's in a food hall. Um, it's vegan Jamaican food, so she has voxtails instead of oxtail. Um, I wasn't with it because you guys know alkaline vegans don't eat those type of things. Um, I don't know what it was made of. She said it's not soy, but it did. I didn't really like the, the texture of it, but I did have the oxtail gravy. <laughs> and I had some macaroni and cheese, which was actually really good. And some kale that tastes like collard greens. And I also had some shrimp rice and peas. So the shrimp, guys, is called, it's konjac root or something like that. It's actually good. I don't know if I can eat it all the time, but it was it was actually really good to me. Um, I would definitely eat it again. I wouldn't eat that box tail, but I'll do the shrimp and the rice and all that stuff again. But and to my surprise, I didn't feel like sick after. So, <laughs> um, but I do eat 90% of the time, 95% of the times I cook at home. So, which is also a plus, guys. So I just want to throw that little snippet in here. So if you are interested in going to that restaurant it did take a little long for us to get our food um which i thought i was a little surprised because it is a food hall um but it did take quite some time oh i did have <laughs> i had a lot of food i also had a spinach patty which was okay i think she could probably do some shrimp or something and like some curry or something like that that'll probably be better because i don't i don't eat um spinach but that's it guys, I just wanted to come over here and chat with you guys about my Invisalign and that quick little story about Bad Gal Vegan Restaurant in Marietta, Georgia guys. So if you like videos like this of me just chit chatting, comment below, let me know. Um, like I said, I haven't been doing vlogs often, but I need to pick back on it. My website is finally up, so I have a lot more time to do other stuff for YouTube. Um, and that's it guys. So if you like videos like this, please comment below. And if you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco, we see you. Guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NY. And comment below anything you want me to talk about. 
you guys can always head to my DM, ask me anything, and I can do a video for you guys. So this channel is for you and what you like to see, and I am always all ears and open to it, guys. So I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.